Hey everybody, it's Neil. Check out what I have here. I have a kitchen timer and I'll show you guys what this is and kind of how it works and explain how I will use it. So it comes with its own batteries as well. So that's good. Okay, so it's got three AAA batteries to make it work. And then this is the device here. So let me open this up. Uh, if you guys like that satisfying peel of that, you get to see that. Let me open up the battery compartment. So now we have the batteries and they go just like normal batteries go inside. And I already heard the beep. I must have turned it on. There we go. And it's got like a little rubbery kind of backing on it. So that's kind of nice. So that if it goes on a counter, it won't counter, <laughs> won't slide so much. So, and it came with the instructions here. Hopefully there's English ones too. Yes, the English user manual is this. Um, not sure I'm gonna need it, but let's try. So here you push this one here to make it go. And then here is, it's counting up. So if you want to time how long you have to do your uh, eggs for or something like that, you can say you can set it when you start cooking. So then if someone says, hey, how long has the eggs been cooking? You can say, well, 13 seconds. So if you have a five minute egg or something like that, you can set that up. So, and you push the button to stop it and push it again to continue. Pretty cool. So that is the one there. And then if you want to do a countdown timer, it looks like it has that ability as well. I think I have to stop it here. So do countdown, turn the knob to the desired countdown time. So let me see, how do I do that? Oh, it's got a brightness control on the back. I don't know what that one did. Uh, brightness, oh, sound, sound of the volume control. That's what that is, volume. And then so you can turn it. So volume setting is on the back. Turn the knob to set the desired countdown time. Turn the knob right to increase the value and turn it to the left to decrease the value. So I'm gonna guess I'm going to have to reset it. Oh, there, reset it. And now I can set my countdown timer. So this is gonna count down for a very long time. So let's say I wanna do 16 minutes and 45 seconds. And there, now it's gonna count down for that much time. So pretty cool that it has all these different little features to it. So then you could set your five minute eggs and set it there and the little beep one is done. So super cool, cool little countdown timer. Really nice and super convenient. And it's got the little stand so you can kind of leave it like that. It's funny, it stays, it knows to stay straight even though it's round. It must have a little nub in the bottom. So it stays that way. Yeah, <laughs> it knows to stay straight. So pretty cool, very cool. So in 16 minutes, I'm gonna hear some beeping, but very cool. I like this little timer, thumbs up.